Oh boy, it's this game. The one that everyone's been talking about, those that'll probably suffer from over uh, exposure, just like Five Nights at Freddy's. But that doesn't mean I can't try it. Dear Henry, it seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. 30 years really slips by, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey Joa. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, it's, uh, uh, I don't have a controller. <laughs> uh, okay. E interact, uh, shift to run, uh, space to jump. I can jump in this game? Oh. Look at this cute little guy down there. Oh, I hate cute. All right, Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Hey, no, I wanted to do the talking, you ass. Aren't you just a bundle of joy? Uh huh. He looks like a mix between Goofy and Banjo Kazooie. Call that a run? That's like a trot at best. You worked in a corner? Are you sure this wasn't your office? Because I don't know, dude. This looks like to be a better office than, you know, uh, suspended little corner with Bendy constantly staring at you. You better get the work, pal. Joey is not going to be happy when he sees you just slagging around. Do you want to work under the stairs next time? <laughs> uh. Oh. That was the camera. It scared the shit out of me. I really like the look of this game. You know, I'm going to be honest. I like the idea of a who. Huh? Nope. Dreams come true here at Disneyland. There's a nice beat going on there. Hey, dude! Can I join? <coughs> oh, no. oh no, don't tell me. Hey! So this is the ink machine. Huh? I wonder how you turn it on. Could you not? Hang on. Don't tell me the people are back already. Oh, God. Don't tell me my roommates are already back. Well, someone's knocking on the door. That's what's going on here. Yeah, gee, now I gotta put on pants? Uh-oh. I'll be right back. Uh, be right there. I don't mean to be rude and just divert from you guys, but I'm currently in the ink machine. Uh, how do I uh, turn you on? So like, uh, could you help me out here? Are you maintenance? Are you the maintenance bendy? Ugh. It's the right ink machine. We all we've all had a bit too many drinks sometimes. Do I gotta go back? Do I gotta do something else? Do I have to make more cartoons? Is this always open? I don't know. I'm gonna go with it. Ah! Well, fucking Christ, dude. I don't know if I should be in here. Place is just gonna fall on my fucking head. God damn. I never felt this unsafe. Joey, what, were you doing? what did you do to Goofy? Oh, yuck. His name isn't Goofy. It's Boris the Wolf, obviously. Don't you know? This reminds me of one apartment um, that I actually looked at. It was very, very cheap. I, dude, shut up. Find objects. Oh, now we're in slender. Anyway, uh, it was a really cheap apartment. It was like 400 uh, 500 a month. Uh, which is considerably cheap for everything else we've been uh, finding. And hey. 
Hey, you're a little too, cl too close for comfort. Do you, uh, do you need something? Anyway, uh, but the place was, I, I have, like, low standards, alright? I'm just gonna say this right now. Uh, I try my best not to, like, uh, complain about, like, everything that's thrown at me and, uh, I'll have a book. Uh, everything, why are you glowing? Are you gonna be voice thing? The animation, sure, but it does like a kid. I'm gonna complain, go and complain. Hey, you're getting money for this. Don't complain. You need to make a lot of cartoons. The gods. His name is Wally Franks. Is that a reference that I'm not getting? Anyway, back to the story. It was, I have low standards, so I'd be okay with a lot of things as long as I can make it work, make it my own. Uh, and I don't want to scream, shout, and complain about uh, something that I could obviously make better, but this place was just downright low and awful. Okay, I guess not. Uh, the stairs were made out of plywood. The stuff that were made to give you fucking splinters. Uh, the kitchen was rolled rusty and I swear and decaying at this point. And I swear to God, I thought I was gonna find a hand in the stove. Uh, a lot of the equipment was from like the early 1900s, uh, back when like stoves and fridges were like a whole new concept. It was dirty as hell. No point in cleaning that shit. Because, and you go upstairs. It's huge. It's spacious, and I like that. But like the floor is really creaky. Uh, Bits are falling out when they're not supposed to, and there's a Bible in every room. I don't have a problem with that because, you know, uh, it's probably someone else's Bible and they probably forgot to get it. But I'm just wondering why. There was even one in the bathroom. It's just, like, weird. Oh, fuck. Oh, I needed that? Okay. So, uh, and this is a point in time where I had to move in with someone else for a while, move in with my mom, uh for a little bit before I get my shit back together. That was in 2016. Oh, yeah, I needed you, cutie pie. Anyway, it was just, it was just a hassle. Uh, oh, now these are moving. W were they always moving? Hmm. Uh, I, I could do that. Hey. <laughs> Hey guys, I think there's a spooky ghost in here. No way, Jimmy! Oh, really? Dave, stop it! Oh, do I need that? That seems like something I might need. Oh, yes, I do. That's four. How many do I need, actually? Do I need anything from my desk? That'll be very symbolic and uh, predictable. And then I'd greatly appreciate it if it was either, because I honestly don't care. I'm a symbol man. No, I guess not, alright. Do I go back where I came from? No, I, no. I have a question. How did this guy who stumbled into this old office from years ago figure out to do all this? Like, oh, there's pedestals. I obviously have to put these specific objects on here. Video game logic. It's not terrible logic. I mean, it can be, but... What else do I need? Did I... Did I skip it by accident? Is that it? Do I need this thing? Or something? I don't know. There's no reels in that, so... I'll admit something. I love old black and white cartoons. They're just like... There's something so whimsical about them, you know? I, I don't know how to put it. I know it sounds very weird and confusing for me to say that. Do I need you? Do I need you? Do I need you? I need you. I need gear. You could... Next object be here, please? No. Hey, Bendy. How's it going? My eyes are up here, asshole! Oh, sorry. Do I have everything? Do I? No. Also, I like how all these are just levitating in the air. Very visually appealing, but also... Imagine if this is happening in real life. I, I would not think this is appealing. I'd be getting the hell out of here. I need one more thing. I need... I don't know what I need. 
Let's see. How do the objects coincide? So they don't. That's the thing. Is the last last one where uh, this guy was, Mr. Boris? Very symbolic. If there was an object in this room, Jesus. Why would it be a film reel? There's so many of them. If it was one of the film reels, it would have been like one that was like blatantly obvious. And how long has this place been abandoned? It had to have been abandoned. Oh, do, do I do I do I take one of you? No, fuck. Do I take you? Are you? Are you? No. Ah. Eh. Once again, he called us a fucking run. This is like a trot at best. You fucking. A oh, wall, 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 move. You know, we never, like, we see horror products like movies and games, always, like, in abandoned hospitals and asylums and uh, hotels. we have I don't think I've ever seen one in an animation studio, so I give you props. Good job, Mr. Meatly. Made a cool idea. I don't know, I just love it when any horror game that tries something different or tries to give itself a personality, so I already like this game. Now, is there anything, anything? I, I, did I skip it? The hell? The hell, dude? I must have. There's nowhere else it could be. What the fuck is this bullshit? Ugh. Remember how I mentioned in the beginning of this video that this game uh, could suffer from overexposure? Uh, I mentioned in the Five Nights at Freddy's Red Room that it exploded in popularity. Uh, but quickly died off to the point where no one really cared about it anymore. And I, I'm afraid that's what's going to happen to this game because it's essentially become the new Five Nights at Undertale. And which is a good thing for um, exposure, but overexposure can lead to dastardly things. Are you sure it's not you? Ugh. Jesus, where is it? Is it behind you? Is it in here? No? I mean, that would have been genius. Is it you? Is it you? Yes! 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 Okay, that's all of them. Yes! Oh, I gotta go all the way back there! I fuck off! I can start with the main power. <laughs> Did I just come back here to do chores? Face it, I was never good at making cartoons! You don't need to hide it from me, Joey Drew! I was awful! Hey, uh oh. You come here to say hi, little buddy? Aren't you just fucking cute? I didn't really see you as scary. I saw you as adorable. Oh! I'm watching cartoons. I like cartoons in general. Uh -uh. Why do you think I make so many videos about the animation industry? All right. You are a pain in the ass. Another knocking, this has to be the landlord. Ugh. I gotta finish this now. I've been recording for almost half a fucking hour. So many interruptions. God damn it. Go. Do your thing. Did you Wait, did you already do it? Ah. <laughs> Flick the thing. Just go. Just go, damn it. Get this done and over with. I believe it was around this corner. Well, I know this place off the back of my hand now since I've been going to... Well, great. Well, great, Jesus. Where do I go? This way, okay. I'm leaving, I'm out of this bitch. Okay, okay. I'm falling now. I got an achievements. Hey, Bendy. Was that Bendy? Ah, uh, he looked a bit too real for my taste. You know, that plank of wood scared me more than Bendy actually did. I like this game. It's very subtle. It doesn't rely on jump scares all day. Except for that one, but that... I don't care if a game has like a few jump scares. Do, do, I, do I use this? Okay. Great, now I'm going deeper into the depths. What do I do? Do I go in here? Yes, I do. Yes, I do go in here. 
Uh, I'm, uh, seems I'm a little... Well. Oh! Metal axe! This I mean... Oh, yeah, definitely. To kill the demons. And the boar's wolves. Just gotta clear this off. You don't know video game logic might kick in. It, good job. Good job. There you go. Jesus. Out of the way! I'm on a rampage! Yo, bitches! Yep. Really? But really? Okay. Oh, really? You're in my way? Oh, well, like I said. What did I fucking say? No man! Here's Johnny! Oh. Oh, hey Satan! How you doing today? Floor's all rumbly. Well. I'll just go. Just leave. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, I guess I can. Oh, okay. Hey Satan. How you doing? What the? What, what the? Uh, what the? And to, oh, all right then. Well, this has been interesting, to say the least. Well, that was a fun little thing. Maybe I'll buy chapter two. The first chapter was free, uh, free on Steam, so. Uh, everything has basically been done by the Meatly, except for this guy named Mike Mood. <laughs> Isn't he stuck in a bad mood? <laughs> he did the music? He wrote the music too? Oh, <laughs> neato. Doesn't the Meatly also do game jams? Wasn't the Meatly also inside Indie Game Battle? Yeah. Does that mean we can have Bendy inside Indie Game Battle? There are more songs here than I thought there'd be. Bendy will return. Bam, bam, bam! Can I leave now? Can I go? Oh. Oh. Hey, little fella. Hey, <laughs> how you doing? Why aren't you just adorable? I wouldn't mind seeing actual cartoons of this guy. Can I go now? And it went full screen for some odd reason. <laughs> okay.